language of cinema is something that happens when you go from one uh, shop to another. If you are going from one shop to another and it has nothing to do with storytelling, then it has something else. And this is something that you can only have in movies. This is a typical example of how the director put two shots together through a meaning without saying anything. Not only will reminds her the death of her daughter, but it also can be understood as she's sympathizing for the next generation of women in the Vietnamese society. In a symbolic way, this movie is very violent. Hôm nay mẹ không muốn ăn cơm một mình. Mẹ muốn anh lên ăn với mẹ. Con cũng lên. The cat violence that is even more painful than the physical one. The son acts as the reminder of the replacement of her husband. Anh đi đâu đấy? Đi dạo một chút. The violence comes from the neglection of the one who caused the pain or the fear of hurting someone's feeling by revealing the truth. This cap violence that requires a lot of spectacle to represent is nothing compared to this. One does not complain about one's suffering, but keep it in private. The frame within the frame composition gives us the privilege to pick in the character private moment. This is the portrait of how the traditional Vietnamese people handle their emotion by not revealing the truth until it's revealed. You cannot go just from one shot to another only because you have a story to tell. The director doesn't say exactly what does this scene mean. The viewer is pulled out of the movie to think about the similarity between a life of a human and an ant. Story no longer plays an important role. In the same cap image, this has other meaning. Most of the symbols are the representations of men and women girls in the Vietnamese society. Already in the title of the movie, the same means Mui in Vietnamese. The name of the main character, Mui, is the green papaya, a symbol for the shape of women in the unripping form. Women that give birth and nurture the whole society with their white milk, only valuable in certain age. Thôi thôi, đủ rồi đó con. Con đủ đủ thừa thì con để đâu bà? Con bỏ nó đi đi. Mui loves the nature around her. Take care of it like an innocent child. On the other hand, men find nature as a space to release his repression. Or even make fun out of it. Women handle everything in the family, from domestic chores to business. Dạo này buôn bán thật ế ẩm. Why men play music and hanging around? Mẹ ơi, chúng con đi nhé. Tí nữa khuyến với con về uống trà với ba. Con đã nói với ba rồi. Ờ, vậy thì chưa. Mẹ sẽ cho mùi đi mua bánh. Chào ba. Đi đi các con. But suffering for the family is their happiness. Nhưng mấy lần trước, ông chủ về, bà chủ có nói gì không? Không. 
không nói gì hết mà bà lại mừng đến khóc despite generation To serve the plane, fly to the Western world with traditional women making Western food. Westernized women actively seduce men with their commodities. They violate men's private space. Sân trong nhà mình bỏ trống như vậy uổng quá. Em đang tính không biết mình có nên nuôi thêm đàn két không? Ừ, để xem. Em breaking the tradition. Mẹ em có kể lại là ngày xưa, ở những gia đình gia giáo, người mẹ phải dạy cho con gái là không được sờ vào đầu chồng. They don't try to keep their emotion in private. <cười> Mo tried to keep her away from this temptation of the commodity and diligently served the man. But more than man doesn't want to give up his benefit of the tradition. The similarity is that they cannot escape the attraction between men and women. <laughs> 